that shit hard. There's a lot of lot that come with that. Then once you get them, you gotta keep. Them. Yeah. And then I ain't big on the internet, so I don't be quick to post. Then I ain't good like at looking at the camera and making videos and talking to it yeah. and shit like that. I ain't good at acting. So Instagram kind of hard for me. I'm getting to it now though. Yeah, that's good, man. That's that's what's up, man. How you be taking the fame? Like you know what I'm saying? Like when people approach you and be like, man, they go Ooh. like how you be feeling? Like when we gonna take pictures and shit, do it. Man, I ain't gonna lie. Um, that shit happened a lot. Like, that shit happened a lot. Like, whether it's, um, it's a nigga from Chicago to do skits, his name Corporate. Mm, yeah, like, I know that, Corporate. That look like me and shit. So, yeah. we, um, I can be in Atlanta, a motherfucker might be in Atlanta. Like, man, boy, you look like Corporate. So, it does. I just always get interaction with people, you know what I'm saying? Whether they think I'm him, whether motherfuckers around here be. Crazy about me. Like, I'll be walking through Walmart, even white kids. One day, this white kid went past the aisle, came back, like, <gasps> dude, no, 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 NB Gill. Like, I'm like, whoa. <laughs> I be seeing this shit. Like, I'm walking in Walmart with um with my gal one day, and it's like a little kid walking out holding her parents' hand, and she just looking at me like, and I'm just looking like, oh, the fuck on. Yeah. Like, and she just starstruck, so. That shit be happening to me a lot. People don't even believe me. My homie thought I paid this little dude like two weeks ago to run to run down on me. I don't even. Yeah. Just natural just, energy. It just be yeah. happening. Yeah, but a lot of people don't know I rap. A lot of people be on them clothes. You right, got to think about it. I done sold probably a lot of clothes. 10,000 yeah. jumpsuits. Man. Hey, that's what's up, bro. <laughs> that's crazy. Like, you stay in the mall and uh, Walmart looking like, damn, man. Yeah, you know, dude, man. dude, walk past. He walking with a gal. That's why I'm like, I got to get the youth. Right. Like when I be looking at my statistics, I got a good group. Like my my fan base is like males, mm -hmm. twenty eight to thirty four, okay. and I be telling people like, I was discouraged because I ain't always got a lot of streams. You feel right. me? Right. So it's like um trying to get the youth. Once I youth. got some streams, like and it was coming from twenty eight to thirty four, I was telling my people, I'm like, man, you know what? It ain't it ain't it, it ain't it ain't it ain't horrible. You know what I'm saying? It's a good start because I feel like. Motherfuckers who 28 to 34, I mind made up. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Like, how old is you? 39. You 39, but when you 34, you ain't your mind made up on who you want to listen to. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, That's I'm just me. I'm 28. Yeah. So I'm like, shit, at my age, I ain't just going to be listening to anybody. So if I got this group of niggas listening to my shit, right. oh, yeah, I'm doing good. The rest going to be easy. Absolutely. So I start trying. I had a lot of clothes just sitting around, start giving it to females and shit like that. Hey, promote this. Wear this. Hey, man, you know I yeah. rap, man. Listen to this. I think you're going to like this shit. You know what I'm saying? Having conversations with different people, feeding the shit to them, they start liking it. And mm -hmm. guess what? I go back to my shit a month later, and I got um, 30,000 streams, mm -hmm. and I got um, females on my shit now. You know what I'm saying? Man, you already know. That still ain't a lot, but it's progression for me. I, I, I live off progression. You know what I'm Absolutely. saying? I ain't focused on nobody else. You know, I be looking at niggas be having Cuddy dropping, got 500,000 <laughs> streams. You know what I'm saying? I can't focus on that, though. No. I ain't Cuddy. Man, right. You know, we all got a different story. Yeah, that's that's right. You feel me? So, like I say, but it's a blessing. I had to look at my blessing, cause nigga, huh? Cuddy can't go and sell twenty thousand worth of merch in a week. I'm just gonna say he can't go you know sell merch like that. You so know what I'm saying? it's just like, and I be trying to get him on that merch. I be letting him know, like, man, this shit really pay off. But I, that's yeah. just that's just the blessing. I had to, I had to really sit back and think, like, damn, like, man, I be really complaining. That niche is what's gonna really get you super known. That like you already see where yeah. it's going. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But I just, I just couldn't understand, like, motherfucker, give me $150 for a jumpsuit, but you won't even give me, you you won't go download this $10 mixtape. Look, <laughs> one of my videos got, like, 30,000 views, and I'm like, why I don't got 30,000 subscribers? You know what I'm saying? Y'all mm -hmm. went and watched this video, like, just it don't even cost to subscribe. Just click the button, shit, you know what I'm saying? But you know how it is. I, I feel like. The out of towners is gonna be the ones that support us more. You know what I'm saying? You know how it is with us in our city, man. Yeah, see, know? I think I really think God gave us a purpose, and we try to force other shit. You know what I'm saying? It ain't about what you want to be. It's about what these fit folks want you to be for real. And that's what I had to realize. Like, man, I had to use one. I gotta start using this shit to do that shit. You know what I'm saying? Now I, I got it. Like, man, I can sell merch, but I can't sell this music. All right. Now when I drop this mixtape, I'm finna drop some merch along with it. That's right. You feel me? So guess what? You come and get this motherfucking hoodie. I go and sell 50 hoodies. Yeah, I can go pay for an interview now. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to use it like that, like marketing. Y'all want this merch? All right. But guess what? You're going to get the music too. Yeah. You know? I'm trying to find, do all type of shit. My boy has sent me a company out of um, Philadelphia. 
that put like the little um, technology in your shit, like what Nip- Nipsey Hussle was doing, to where oh, I could yeah. sell some merch and motherfucker hub over my logo and get the mixtape. I sell saying. a lot of merch, so I feel like once yeah. I can do that, it's, it's you a wrap. You find the uh, back door to that shit. You yeah. know what I'm saying? I'm gonna get in. Yeah, you gonna, I'm gonna get, get in. in. Like yeah, it ain't yeah, yeah. you ain't you ain't gonna keep me out. You yeah, know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's, I got that's the dope. hard part down packed. There's a lot of niggas. Yeah, once I get in with the music, get a lot. You know, shit. Kim K might put on my motherfucking sweater and I might sell a million units overnight. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? I got 50 million overnight. Them clothes dangerous. Damn right. Absolutely. You get a hit with them clothes. It's a wrap. You know what I'm saying? 50 million people order a hoodie. A million people, a thousand people. That's 50K real quick. You know what I'm saying? Absolutely. So I just try to, I focus, I focus on the clothes. Mm-hmm. Try to put equal work in with both of them though. You know what I'm saying? Like nighttime, I'm on that music. Daytime, I'm here. You know, that's, that's, you know what I'm saying? It's a it's a it's an even grind, like you balancing that shit out. You know what I'm yeah, saying? But I just gotta learn how to incorporate the music with them clothes. Nah. Cause ain't no way I done sold all these jumpsuits and these <laughs> folks don't know I make, make yeah, music. Yeah, you know? make music. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, it's coming kind of up, man. But uh, I definitely uh, like I say I've been watching you since the uh, you and Cuddy, and I just been keeping up. I'm like yeah, okay. He probably little brothers. I already know they work and they just they they from the start. Rotate, you know what I'm saying? Bugatti, I know he in the studio. I know he got a lot of shit going on. And I really feel like y'all two is kind of like the, 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 the ones, you know what I'm saying? You know? Yeah. I feel like y'all two the ones that really got to really kind of hold that torch and take it to the next level. Because Bugatti going to seem like, you know, he going to get to that level where he going to kind of start kicking back. You know what I'm saying? Bugatti already got his feet up. Right? Yeah, he, 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 he really got it like it's not. Like, I'm, I'm be watching, like, he yeah. kind of got his feet up. Yeah, it's kind of, but it's like we needed to get rich and he needed to right. get out the streets. Absolutely. You know what I'm saying? Like, everybody needed. Yeah. Like, we can say who needed for what reason, but at the end of the day, we all needed. You know what I'm saying? So, hmm. but shit, hopefully we go this year. I ain't no hopefully we gonna go this year. We could have went last year. Bugatti turned down a crazy deal too. Yeah, I ain't even gonna tell you about it. I'm gonna let him tell you. Oh yeah, oh yeah, hell yeah, yeah. Say that for my dog. That's what's yeah, up, man. I'm gonna tell you. Well, I appreciate, man, you for sitting down with us, man. We definitely uh gonna keep spinning with y'all guys, man, and uh keeping up, man. We're gonna get some merch in, We're gonna do all that. We definitely uh we got the Chop Talk Key is getting ready to drop soon, so we about to Go crazy too, man. Cause like you just said, with the youth is where it's at. You know what I'm saying? The kids is where it's at. You gotta build them up, they next. You know? and once you we grab think. them, it's it's over with. <laughs> once you grab yeah. them, it's over with. Hey, what's crazy? Um, uh, when you start doing it, I want to interview my young boys. I got some motherfucking. Um, I got a little promo group that I got called them babies. Oh uh, um, yeah. Yeah, I got some little kids in high school. I've been giving them free merch, been have them running around the school promoting the music and shit like that. Oh uh, yeah. So the next time I holler yeah. at you, I'm gonna have you them slick. kids. On you slick. You already know. What yeah, I don't play. I don't <laughs> yeah. play no games. I already got a logo made for them and everything. I want to give them a different face. I don't want the reg- original baby. I don't want them to be mud brothers. You know what I'm saying? I don't want everything we got going on to attach to them. So I made them another little logo. Yeah, it's different, right? right yeah, right. absolutely. Yeah. Them babies, man. Be on the lookout for them boys, man. It's up. Yeah, I know what it is, man. My dog even be guilting this motherfucker, man. Chop talk TV, big business, man. Y'all know yeah, this I, ain't that. Ain't keeping no score. So we ain't keeping score on nothing we do.